We are in for some cold temperatures. The showers will hold off until Sunday. We're seeing temperatures around 42 degrees in Alpena. It's 44 in Harrisville. Atlanta's already down into the 30s, coming in at 39 degrees. We're seeing winds out of the west around 8 miles per hour here in Alpena. 12 miles per hour in Harrisville. Skoda just dropped their wind speed to 7 miles per hour, so the winds are beginning to relax a little bit, and we are seeing wind speeds of 11 miles per hour in Onway and in Atlanta. On the radar and satellite image, we are seeing mainly cloudy skies across the area. The radar is trying to pick up on some drizzle around Tawas, but most of that, if it's reaching the ground, is quite light and uh, just a lot of thick cloud cover across the area. Cloudy skies in Alpena with temperatures around 42 degrees, but because of the breeze to your exposed skin, it feels like 36. We're seeing winds out of the west at 8 miles per hour, and the relative humidity is fairly comfortable at 57%. All of the warmth we saw earlier in the week has departed well to the east. New York is still seeing temperatures in the 60s, but it's 49 degrees in Buffalo and to our northwest. It's even colder. 32 degrees right now in Marquette, 38 degrees in Green Bay, and we will be seeing our temperatures dropping to the lower 30s tonight. What is left of what had been Hurricane Michael has departed well to the east off the coast of Maine. So the U.S. is done with any impacts from Michael. We are seeing a fairly broad system bringing some showers to parts of lower Michigan all the way down through Illinois and Missouri. This will be staying to our south. Clearing skies over Minnesota and North Dakota are heading our way tomorrow. On our future cast for tonight, we're still dealing with plenty of cloud cover, but as we get toward tomorrow morning and into the afternoon, we will be seeing that cloud cover break apart. Partly cloudy skies tomorrow, but also some very chilly temperatures. Then as we go into the day on Sunday, we will see some scattered showers from the northwest entering the area. And uh, Sunday is definitely looking more showery, but we will see some warmer temperatures for the second half of the weekend. For tomorrow, high pressure over Indiana is bringing fair weather, a little more sunshine. We're going to see cool temperatures across much of the upper Midwest. This cold front entering Minnesota tomorrow will be into Michigan on Sunday, producing some showers. And then behind the cold front, colder air from the northwest will move in as we go into Monday. If you're going to our high school football game of the week in Posen, we are looking at temperatures in the lower 40s to start, dropping to the upper 30s, winds out of the west 5 to 10 miles per hour, and mostly cloudy skies this evening. For tonight, low temperatures dropping to 32 degrees in Alpena, 30 degrees in Oscoda, upper 20s in Atlanta and Mayo with mostly cloudy skies. We will see partly cloudy skies during the day tomorrow with high temperatures close to 50 degrees. A very cold start to the day with temperatures in the lower 30s in the morning, a high of 50 in the afternoon, and then partly cloudy skies tomorrow evening with temperatures dropping to the lower 40s. For tomorrow, a little more sunshine, highs around 50 degrees after a cold start in the morning. We'll see a chance for some showers on Sunday, but also warmer temperatures, 54 degrees. After the cold front comes through cooler on Monday, highs only in the upper 40s, a chance for showers early on Monday, clearing late in the day. A dry day on Tuesday, partly cloudy, highs close to 50. Showers early on Wednesday, possibly mixing with a few flurries. Early morning lows in the 30s, highs only in the mid 40s. But towards the end of the upcoming week, we'll see more sunshine and warmer temperatures around 50 degrees on Thursday, then mid-50s next Friday.